Well, Mo, welcome to Peterborough United. I guess the first question, you've had so many offers from different clubs. Why Peterborough? Um, it's the one that I think they wanted me the most. Um, they showed the most interest and um, the most serious about me. And um, obviously when I met the, the chairman, uh, the gaffer as well, um, showed nothing but love for me. And um, that's what I really need. Yeah, and I, and I think it was a move that nearly happened a year or so ago, and that shows, as you say, that they people didn't go away. They wanted to make sure they got you here, and here you are. Yeah, of course. Like the first, uh, the first time I think they wanted me was uh, I was at Cheltenham, and um, when they came in for January. But at the time, I didn't think I was sort of ready in it because uh, I've come from non-league, and and now, um, so still serious about me, just shows uh, like they really wanted me. Yeah. Mm. And the manager obviously has, um, has spoke really highly of you and, and, and wants to sort of, I don't want to say mould the team around you, but he wants someone who's got that pace up front and, and that must be really good to hear that the manager is uh, is so desperate to get you in. Yeah, it's nice like to be like, uh, I won't say like they're trying to plan everything around me, but it's not it's not that, I just want someone that's that's going to get in behind and I like, I like getting in behind, that's my, that's my game. So um, it's... I'd, it's nice to have something that they want. So, so yeah. And you're a scorer of all types of goals. We've had a look at your, your compilation of goals from Cheltenham, and you, you can score both feet in in the box, in outside the box, obviously with your head as well. I, do you describe yourself as a sort of all round striker? Uh, I don't know. Not, not really. Uh, but I, like I do score different types of goals. It's um, obviously I like to get a few on my left, but that don't really matter. Uh, I like to get a few close range ones as well, but. Um, yeah, all, all round goal scorer. And, and your time at Bristol City, obviously, you didn't get the, the game time you probably wanted, but I guess it was a learning experience as well because you've gone up to a higher level, different types of players, different type of manager, and intensity. How did you find your time there? Uh, it was obviously a learning curve. Like mentally, it was good for me. Like playing with the players there, the very good players. Obviously, you're competing with like like really top class players there, and. Um, like I settled in well. Um, it's just obviously like sad I didn't get the game time um, for for whatever reason. And um, obviously like it's just uh, it was a good experience to have. So obviously like in the future if I was to go through that, I know what I need to do, sort of thing. And um, yeah. and in terms of playing first team football, every player wants to play first team football, and that's ultimately what you were looking for when with this move come about. You want to make sure that you get the chance to bang in the goals again. Yeah, of course. That's all. That's all. That's that. All our like, players want and want to play football. Wherever it is, um, we just want to keep playing. Um, if you're not playing, then you're not enjoying football. So obviously, this is hopefully it's a chance for me to start playing again, enjoy my football, and obviously try get Peter to the championship. Yeah, I know it's been going on a little while in the background, but you must be pleased that now it is all completed. You can have a little bit of time off in preparation for pre-season. Yeah, it's good that obviously this move's done early. That like, last one, Bristol City, well, I think was a bit um, like sort of deadline day sort of kind of rust and this one's good getting out of the way early and I could go away really think about it train um, for my pre-season coming back and and I'm yeah, delighted it's done early yeah, in terms of Peterborough as a club, you, obviously you played against us in pre-season. I know for Cheltenham and the chairman was sort of saying, "Hey, you sort of ran us ragged." But you, you know about the, the the strikers that have come through here and obviously gone on to bigger and better things. I, I guess the the fact that strikers come here and score goals was a big attraction to you as well. Yeah, of course. Like all the like um, Jack Marriott, uh, Dwight Gill, like everyone that scores here really gets a uh, gets the move gets a move. But um, it's not about this. It's not about that. Obviously, um, you just want to do well for the team. Um, I'm not, I'm not selfish. Uh, like the main objective of the season is to get promoted, and it's not about me scoring how many other goals. But uh, I, that's what I'm, I bring to the team. Or I try to bring to the team, but uh, that's the main reason I'm here, just to get promoted to the championship. Yeah, and I know the chairman wants to set a goal target, but every striker has their own goal target in their mind, don't they? They try and keep that private. But you, you know that you can score goals at League Two level, and I guess it's just transferring that now to this level. Yeah, of course. Uh, I, I'd like to think if if I had like uh, the the game time at Bristol, I thought I'd. Uh, I thought I would score goals, but obviously I have to think like that. Otherwise, there's no point. Um, so me think coming here, um, I like to think I'll score goals, um, and I'll do my best. And just finally, how much are you looking forward to that day one? Because when you were signed for a new club, that first day of pre-season was a bit nerve-wracking, meeting new people and all that kind of stuff. Are you someone that can just block all that out and get get down to business? Yeah, because um, I've like I've been in the situation a few times uh, with clubs, so um, it's not really. It's not really nerve-wracking for me. Um, like, like I said, Bristol was a good uh, experience. Like I settled in so quick, so I'm hoping to settle in here so quickly as well.